Morning guys, YouTube people, world everywhere, wherever, wherever, wherever. Went to, uh, got back from Walmart and AutoZone and our uh, local office, railroad office. And uh, picked up some oil for the wife's car for an extra oil change, but I think I still have like six quarts in there in the box. So, I'll just put this on a shelf just in case because it's uh, I think it's 12 quarts. Yeah, 12 quarts. 12 quarts. So, we got uh, you joint. I'm trying not to say uh so much because uh, our stupid governor of California, Newsom, I can't stand when he says uh, 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 all day. And his stupid things. So I'm trying to cut down the uhs. Um, because it gives me a headache. So, went to AutoZone. And picked up a U-joint. And I believe it is the right U-joint. We got the clips here. Whatever the heck that thing is. Some type of weird... Zerk fitting? I have no clue. I think what you do, you pull it out. Um, anyway, here's the part number. It's a 235, made in Mexico. Echo, 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 in Mexico. Fiat Ox Mex Q. Anyway, make you joint. 235 is the number. So, um, sorry, I'm um, again. She picked up, she, uh, <laughs> I just can't do the, uh, Anyway, she selected, uh, oh my gosh, a 1992 Chevy K1500. And we have a U-joint. It is the same size, same size cups, same size chingaderas, same size all the way around. So if you have a 91, K1500 it probably has a 92 uh, drive shaft in it so armor wrap yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and do an install video on this um and get them get rid of these freaking arms going to put a zerk fitting in it after I get it installed I'm gonna pump zerk pump crap in there and then I'll end up putting this little Zerk cap, whatever the heck that stupid thing is, on there. So, let me uh, get this thing set up. And I can't stop saying, uh, so you're just going to have to deal with it. I'll have to live with it. I think we can get rid of the treadmill out of the garage. Because the wife is starting to go back to the gym. So, I'm going to clean all this up in here with a little uh, wire brush thing. And start putting it back together. I'm not going to use a press. I'm going to use a vise. Um, and uh, that's it. So let me get you guys set up over there. See how we're going to do this. I'll be back. Alright. Go ahead and take this little wire wheel. Wire wheel it a little bit.
cheese in there. If we can. I'm gonna try to do I'm try to do both of them at the same time. If I can. So I'm just getting it enough to get the clips on. Let's see. Alright, let me grab something and see if we can't get these clips on there real quick. Okay, not sure if you guys can even see what I'm doing, but I'm trying to put these, just checking to make sure I get some tolerance in there, get the clip in there, that one's in. any good if I'm in the way Okay, we're in. We're all Jesus. As you can see, got the little C clip in there. C clip in there. It's nice, nice and taut. So let me go uh, stick this drive shaft in. I'll be back. Go set you guys up over there.
All right, I'll get it all bolted up and I'll show you guys what it looks like. I think I'm already seeing a problem, but we'll see. All right, guys. <clears throat> I got it installed in here. Put that weird little Zerk fitting thing right in there. This flathead screwdriver. But I don't know if you guys can see that. Looks like I have a, a gap in here. Like as if uh, these cups are supposed to be a little bit bigger. So it looks like the cups got some room in there, which I probably shouldn't have. But um, yeah, I don't really know. As you can see daylight through there I don't think it's supposed to be like that I think we're supposed to have larger cups could be the issue I'm having with trying to find a, a u-joint so that's gonna be it for this video Let's see if uh, Maybe there's some type of shim to put in there, or who knows what. All I know is it's getting warm outside. I'm already hot. So, but that's it. That's all I got for today, the Project Crack Pipe. Go ahead and let you guys go. I'll let you guys go. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Have a good day. Subscribe, comment.